Hello, good afternoon. This is Zorina Spice. Um, this is a new year. We'd like to wish everyone a new year. Happy New Year's to all the subscribers and to everyone that is looking at the video. I want to say thank you guys and a happy New Year's to each and every one of you. Now today I'm going to make some um, eggplant fritters. Also you call it bygani. So this is my, um, my eggplant. I have eggplant here. I also have um, some seasoning. Here is three quarter cup of um, three quarter cup of split peas, which is dal mix. Three quarter cup. I'll be using that. Three quarter cup. Um, this is a measuring cup. Which says this is like three quarter cup, and I'll be using half a cup. Three quarter cup is like um, this here. This one is just for the split peas. Now I'm using half a cup of plain flour. Half a cup of plain flour. So um, I'm, I'm gonna mix them through this together. But this is um, this is um, the mix of this for this. Now I'm gonna show you what I'll be doing. So this is the eggplant. Nice, wrong eggplant. So this is what I'm gonna do now. I'm gonna have to cut it up, so. Okay, so now this is the eggplant. So I'm going to make uh, some slices in this eggplant. So this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to cut it let's see, like this. Well, you know, now we're eggplant, they got seeds or whatever. But I'm going to be slicing it up like a quarter inch of a size thick. This is how I'll be doing it. Like this size here. Continue cut all of them up like this, like a quarter inch thick. So I cut the eggplant up, you know, like a quarter inch thick, maybe half inch if you want. But this is how it um, it looks. You could use the small eggplant and you cut it like maybe half inch. You could peel it if you wish. But I, you know, I, I like it with the skin because it's healthier. You know, the skin carries some certain vitamins, and then um, you could, you know, use it with this. Anyway, um, I want to show you. This is the mixture now as I had here. I have um, this is the flour and the split peas. But now I'll be doing the seasoning. This is the seasoning I'll be using. This is um, some celery, onion, a little bit of rosemary. This is oregano. Uh, cilantro and some garlic and pepper you know sometimes you could compromise if you don't have this seasoning you could do without it too but it's just like it's a nice blend it's flavor the food very nice that's the reason why I'm using them so now I'm gonna grind all this up and I'm gonna show you how to mix it in this flour so in the next step I'll show you that I add, add some salt and I put some black pepper and I'll let it soak a little I prepare the butter okay now this is the butter here, which I ha had the um, three quarter cup of the split peas and uh, the dal mixture, we call it. I put half a cup of plain flour to this. Now I grind some um, um, some seasoning, which I'll be adding into this mixture. This is like a butter mixture. This is the seasoning, all the seasoning that I have here. And I grate it up, I mean grind it up be adding it to, oh it smells good well, I'm gonna um, just rinse it out so that I can get all in so now I'm gonna be making this here I put some water in it because it's supposed to be a little Okay, so this is the mixture here, but I need to put a little baking powder. So I'll be adding like um, a teaspoon of baking powder in this to this mixture. And then I need a little salt. So I'll be adding a little salt too. It's about a teaspoon of salt too. So now I'll be um, mix it all up. Smells really delicious here. Got a nice smell. 
smell too. The spit peas on the seasoning. All right, so I'll be ready to cook it in a few minutes. I'll let it sit a little, and I'll be ready to cook it. And so I'm gonna add some oil here. You gotta put out like a good little oil to so you can fry. I'm gonna be preparing the mixture. Now this is how I um I will soak the butter in, let it well soak, and then I put it in here to fry. Then the fire came up a little hot for us, then you could um lower it a medium. Uh, Okay, you gotta fry now. Then it's time to flip. I'm gonna flip it now. I want to crush the other one, so I should have used this instead. Oh, beautiful, right? So you have to cook. So I think it's finished now. It's finished. I'll drain it a little. And I'll put it in here. I, um, put the butter on it. A medium flame and it's all good so now this here I will turn it now oh, it looks good. so we have to put on medium heat so the inside can cook nice we are little medium fire all right so this um here it's finished it's very important to keep the flame when it's hot to keep it a little low because you don't want to um, burn outside and it's not cooked inside. That's the most important thing. The last set uh, I finished here, so I'll put it there and then. Okay, so I'll drain this set here. Bring the oil out. Now this is um, my eggplant, which you call either eggplant flitters or you could call this um, bigony. But this is how it um, turned out. This is very delicious. You have to try this recipe and you know, you will like it. So this is Zorina Spice. I would like to say goodbye for now. You guys have a good day and thank you for looking. Bye bye.